Hi there! This tutorial will show you how to add cool skins to your Warcraft 3 models in your homemade map. So, uh, we, we need, first of all, we need the Warcraft 3 World Editor, the Frozen Throne Edition. You need the Frozen Throne Edition because you're gonna need a tool called the Import Manager, and that doesn't exist in, that doesn't exist in the Reign of Chaos. So, first we're gonna find a skin. And we're gonna go to HiveWorkshop.com to do that. Because uh, this is a website with a lot of cool skins, models, icons, whatever you need for Warcraft 3, it's here. So we're gonna pr press this uh, skins link. And find a cool skin that we want for our map. So I have this Dracula link. Uh, skin, Dracula skin for the blood mage so I'm gonna download it click here to download dracula.zip and um, I'm gonna download it to a folder called warcraft 3 models skins I have this folder so I know where my stuff is as you see I've already downloaded it some so I'm not gonna do that again um, then I'm gonna close the internet browser and open the warcraft 3 world editor and again, it must be the Frozen Throne edition, because the Reign of Chaos edition does not have an import manager, and that is required. So once you're there, you're gonna have your map here. I have a, I don't have a map for the time. I'm not creating a map for the time, so uh, I'm just getting a new one. And uh, I'm going to the import manager. It's this little icon, or you can press F12 and uh, then I'm gonna import a file and you do that by pressing this button pressing Control I pre right clicking on this background pressing import file or press file and import file so uh, there are a lot of ways to do this and I find my skin and I saved it here and there and I'm gonna just extract the folder because if I don't do that it ain't gonna work and then I'm gonna import it dracula.blp I'm just gonna open the uh, readme file before I do it so uh, um, once I've done that I see that the path is um, war3map imported slash backslash dracula.blp and that ain't good because that's not uh, a texture for any unit. So we go to the uh, readme file and we're gonna find a place where it's written um, set location to this and we're gonna uh, we're gonna copy this and um, then we're gonna paste it in here and make sure it's uh, .blp in the end and uh, once that's done the uh, the skin should be attached to the model. So now we're going to place a blood mage on the map, and we see sadly the model hasn't changed. But that's just in the editor. Once you um, start the map, this should work. So um, I'm just gonna start the map with the blood mage, and uh, I'm just gonna test it. And I am pretty screwed now if this doesn't work, but it it really should. So um, here we have the map, and we have the we have the Dracula model uh, skin. So nothing but the skin has changed for this model, but uh, it works. So here is our Lord Dracula, and uh, he works definitely very good. So that's what I had to tell you for now, thanks for watching, remember to comment and rate.